some people they have the mindset that strawberry cannot grow in the Gambia. Before we grow this strawberry, we were doing this trial and research to see how best we can able to get this strawberry. The best thing motivated us is we wanted to suppress importing strawberry from other countries to Gambia. We can grow in the Gambia here. Here currently, it's only two people are working, me and my brother. So we have bell pepper and guana. And also this area, we have papaya. The idea, we got it from my training after the graduation. That's the time we decided to let we establish our own project here so that we can supply the nation fresh and healthy vegetables. So we all understand that agriculture is key in terms of life. So without agriculture, we will not be able to survive. I believe one of the best ways we can empower youth and women is through skills development, building their capacity. Uh, with that, they will be able to take the lead and the charge of their future. With skills, you have something with you that you can use to be able to have economic gain. With the education, it makes you aware of the opportunities that are available around you and then for you to make best use of um, those opportunities. I get everything that I wanted to get. It was very, very fruitful. The most useful is about the agronomics, how to manage your crop and how to control it, and then when to plant, how to plant, and then where to plant. You know, those are the key. If you are making a site selection, you must select an area of land that is free from pests and disease so that they will not able to destroy your plants. Your effort, I think, is your main weapon. You should not waste it. I grow all my strawberry here. If it started flowering and bearing fruits, it needs a lot of water. One day, we normally water two wise. So we supply details and also a restaurant. Many people like it. The reason why they like it, because it's very palatable. The strawberry is 100% organic and also it doesn't have a lot of heat, direct sunlight. Climate change is affecting a lot of farmers in the Gambia, especially when it started having high temperature. If the sun is very, very, very hot, it will affect the fruit, especially the strawberry. You will just see this fruit start scrambling. You will not be able to test that fruit. In future, we would like to expand this vegetable production. And next year, you will gonna see a very surprising and also very nice gardening at my side. Because we are planning a lot of things, now we wanted to implement. It's not easy, it's not easy to start a business. You must face some challenges, but we are on it. We are trying our levels to see how can we can able to expand the production so that we can control the market and they also venture into international markets.